I don't know why it's suddenly so fucking hot. Celeste should not be. I mean, my, my computer is basically a heater, but Celeste shouldn't be putting it through too much paces. Then again, I am streaming and VTube Studio. So, you know, may, maybe all of that's adding up. All right. Okay. <clears throat> Let's give this a good old schwacking. Theo, you son of a bitch! Oh shit, the block! Fuck you! Oh, fuck you, dude! Fuck you! Oh, of course it's a falling block. Of course they would fuck me with a falling block! What is this? Fucking Tetris? Fuck! Fuck! Alright, I can do this. I can do this. I didn't do this. I almost did it. I missed the I missed the Theo re grab. Oh god, that's so hard. Dash grab grab. Oh. Throw dash grab dash grab throw dash grab dash fuck. Grab dash fuck. Noted. Aha! Yep, that was the solution. We just had to grab dash fuck. Why do I have to bring Theo along? Come on, dude. Really? No! No! Metal Gear. Gear. Otacon. What's the fuck? What the fuck is this shit? Is this one of your anime games, Otacon? The upbeat music is taunting me. Well, we got Theo onto the ledge. Ah! I messed up the, uh, time. Oh, come on! Come on, Theo, you're going a little too far there, buddy. I don't need you to go all the way over there. Oh, hi! Hmm. Hi! All right, very well then. Very well then. Very well then. Very well then. Come on. It's just a simple one, two, 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 one, fuck. There you go, Theo. You can get the heart. Mirror magic! All right. One more B-side down, comrades. Fucking okay, Madeline over here deadlifting this dead weight. Too busy taking selfies. Rude. Rubier! <laughs> awesome. All right. We are on to reflection. Oh, man. I don't want to. All right. We need to do this without dying because I like I like our deaths here. Two, four, six. It's nice. You know, multiples of two. It just very aesthetically pleasing. So we have to not die, chat. Can we do that? Can we do through. Can we do this entire chapter without dying on the B side? First try blind. <laughs> I think we can do this. Chat, I no longer think we can do this. Ah! Ah! No! 
You can get 369. <laughs> Uh, hey Chimera, I hope you're doing uh, fantabulous. No, 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 no. Oh, Chimera into the void. Hydrate, I will endeavor to do that as soon as I'm done hydrating. Ah, delicious. One of your snacks. Well, dang, I guess you don't want any of uh, any of my cheese this evening. All right, well, that's fine. It's just more cheese for me then. I made it. I made it. Ooh, Ooh I like the guitar here. That is very pretty. Hmm, dashing a little too late. Dashing right into that wall. Hi! A little too far left. Music is getting a risk of rain too vibes. It certainly does feel risk of rainy. I've never actually played risk of rain too. I haven't played much of it because I don't know. I liked Risk of Rain more when it was the 2D side scroller. Uh, all right, so we have some bumpers. Ultimately, we need to get up there, but it seems like we need to use the bumpers to get to the feather. Vastly preferred in 3D. Hmm. Hit the side, hit up, crash my face into the pink spikes. Too much momentum. Too much diagonal. You know me, I just love them diagonals. There we go. All right, so we got this guy. Oh, he has spikes for a hair. All right, so me, I guess. Oh, ah! I'm going around the world, around the world. Ah! Damn it. Don't even put you around the slides on Insta. Slime. Oh, is Insta a Roar 2 character? See, I mostly played Acrid. Uh, Acrid's my favorite character in... Uh, Fun fact, they're called Kevin Blocks. Isn't it because the, the designer was named Kevin? The person who made the blocks? Or is, is it like the person who made the sound effect was named Kevin? I'm going too far. Oh, Instagram. You know, that should have made sense, but my brain is potato. Fuck. Acrid is the ghost boy. Yes! I just liked, like, spreading poison everywhere and just running around and killing everything. It was very, very fun. Whee! Huh! I like moving around to fuck too much for the sniper. Ah, oh, 
Oh, this soundtrack is really fucking nice. I love that guitar. Must have been a fun recording session. <laughs> Currently making a food themed slime texture. Ooh. Get some dragon fruit slimes, you know? Poor choice in hindsight. Drecking your choices have consequences. My friend, my friend, you've got to choose better, my friend, my friend. I guess when you're making a gummy jellyfish. Ooh. Gimme jellyfish. Delicious. Oh. oh, I almost went all the way around. Oh. How did that not work? Mm. I made a terrible mistake. I went way too low. Mm. All right. I believe. I believe. I can do this. Come on, Drecky. These, the, the pink spikes make me think of needlers. So it's like I'm getting blasted by needlers to the face. Huh. All right, that time it took. Ah, mm, almost first tried that it seems. Ah, almost second tried that. Almost died and then did die. <laughs> Hit the bottom. <laughs> Angles, how do they work? That's like my one complaint on the bumpers is they are so angle dependent. It can be a little frustrating at times. Oh, there we go. Oh, this one's floating a little bit. Ah, this time we need to actually launch off of it, it seems. I've made a terrible mistake. I love when you look at frogs with a flashlight, their eyes light up like headlights. Frogs are little goobers like that. All right. All right. All right. I, I love just walking off an edge like that. Chase, not far enough. No! The snake with the frog brain. <laughs> I should have I should have waited some more. Come on! Survey says we may got fucked. I got fucked. I got fucked by a non-permeable platform. Ah! Right into spikes. Alright, alright. Yeah, I see how it is. I see how it is. Oh, 
Ooh, we got some momentum on that one, chat. Hey, yo. Hey, yo. Let's go. Let's fucking go. Oh, shit. Ah, shit. All right. What the fresh fuck do we got going on here? All right, we have to hit the feather. We loop the loop. Come around bottom. Dash. Hit the bumper. All right, so I think we need to dash to break this wall. So I think we have to hit the bumper to get over to the right side. Dash, break the wall, come back up, jump, get the double. Wait, no, what? Was that consensual? I think I think my mouth might have run ahead of what my brain was doing because I don't I'm not picking up. All right, I feel like I'm about to be very salty on this solution. Oh, this makes me cry. Okay, so goes right. We need to break that wall up to the feather. Hit the lock. We need to break that wall. So we can get through over here. All right, I this this one's going to be complicated. I just need to I just need to do things. Oh, so every time it... Okay, so I don't need to break those walls. I just need to... Gotcha. How am I supposed to get that feather then? Ah! Ah! Madeline, no! Madeline, no! We go across here. I died. Ah! Ah! All right, we hit this again. I'm a foolish fool who fools. All right, so we hit it again. Grab that. Oh, I see now. Ooh, curved the bullet a little too hard there. Curve the bullet a little too hard once again. Here I am, once again, flying into spikes. Can't deny it, it's my end. They're really, really pointy. You might be asking, Drecky, why do you keep running into those spikes? The answer is, I'm a silly serpent. <laughs> this is a very interesting room, not gonna lie. So here, we hit that. We gotta be fast enough so I can hit it again. I don't know how you don't rage when doing this. I'm so bad at platformers. Uh, it can be frustrating at times. That's why I do have the assist from time to time. But it's more of a matter of, uh, I don't know. It can be really fun to finally execute on a thing. I certainly don't play a lot of precision platformers. Thwomp, no! Or I guess Kevin, no. Ow! 
Ah, it knocked me upwards. Oh, oh. We go around and around and we hit that Kevin. We jump over here. We hit the bumper. We hit Kevin again. All right. That part's a little, little cheeky breaky. Gotta, gotta go fast. I didn't reach it fast enough. Not again, not again. Here I am once again, flying round and round. All right, so I need to get Hmm, that's a interesting one All right, we need to get here here so I think we need to go here. I need to jump up grab that So I can get the lock Hmm <sighs> We got this. We got this, chat. We got this. We just got to execute. Uh, chat, we have fucked this up and we need to reset. Chat, I have died once again. Chat, I come to you once again, having been reduced to eight circles. No, I didn't go over the top fast enough. <laughs> it's he did all. I'm such a silly serpent. <laughs> I touched the shiny purple spikes again. Oh my gosh. They're so pointy. Ah! Survey says I have died. You know, I do have a thing for counting deaths, but I don't, I think I have to set it up per game. And I mean, Celeste already counts my death, so maybe that's a little bit um, unnecessary. Um, obviously, we're going for the 369 deaths. Um, we kind of messed up the uh, the no deaths run of this, you know, uh, if, if you haven't noticed. I didn't curve fast enough. Haskell issue. Really? You're gonna be talking shit? Be talking shit, critter? I feel like the critter did not show up properly. Um, I also feel like I'm about to die. Oh, we survived. Hmm. Thank you, Fox. All right, and I just made some more work for me to unfuck that. But that's for a future Drekki to deal with. We have the Drekki of the present who is trying to climb these mixtapes. Ha! Huh? Oh. No! I dashed the Agnely. Diagonals. My one. Weakness! Um, survey says, dead. You have died. That's what the survey says. I don't know why, I don't know. We weren't even, we weren't even surveying for that, but uh, you managed to write it in. So congrats, I suppose. I keep getting tripped up at that very last jump. Ah. <laughs> Come on, Drecky. You can do this. You can do this, buddy. Ah, we once again run into that little mistake. I, the thing that it, it bounces me up a little bit. So I almost want, 
to go like a little bit lower on it, like diagonal down maybe. So that when it bumps me upwards, I don't run into the spikes. I also need to just get there fast enough. I... Oh! You know what? We're gonna reset. Ah! We failed the re-grab. Oh, ah! And around we go into the spikes. <laughs> All right, that's that's one for the blooper reel. Madeline forgets how to jump. Oh. Ah! Maybe I shouldn't have. Maybe I should wait for it to run into the wall at the end and not like try and jump off early. Maybe I'm just getting a little too froggy and I need to slow my roll a bit. Really? Fuck. I give you a lesson in jumping. All right, so jumping is when you propel yourself upward. Like a spider, which is what jumping is named after. Uh, the eponymous jumping spider is where humans first learned how to jump by mimicking the spider's um, extension of its legs in an upward momentum. Uh, humans uh, learned how to jump. Um, citations? I don't need a citation for that. It's just it's just common knowledge, right? Everyone knows humans learned how to jump from spiders. I shaved me. Your fuck. Call me the captain's daughter. Because they shaved me. Wait, no. That's not how that song goes. Humans are weird, right? Yeah, like. <laughs> so weird. They got all those limbs? Like, weird. I don't know. I don't know how you operate with all of them, you know? My motto is no limbs, no thoughts, no problems. Although I suppose right now I do have a problem. But Madeline does have limbs, so perhaps it's more of a human problem. No, we need to jump up. We don't we need to not use our dash when we get that. Humans learned how to walk for play quad. Yes! Yes. Uh, so great that the fascinating uh, walking simulator. Like, can you imagine how it must have been learning how to walk before um, the co-op technology was developed? Like, humans were basically just crawling around everywhere. Really is very awkward. They don't really put that in the textbooks. You know, it's kind of a embarrassing history fact. <laughs> Using Wasid. Have I ever talked about my cursed uh, movement keyboard bindings? So back when I played first person shooters like Counter-Strike and uh, Quake, um, I used ASDF. And you know, it makes sense, all right? So F for forward, D for down, A for a side, and S for sideways. So like A was left strafe, S was right strafe, D was back and F was forward. <laughs> It makes perfect sense. It's perfect because then it, it left my the upper home row open for other key binds, you know, you can use uh, Q, E, W and R for other stuff. <laughs> Cursed but sensible. <laughs> A-E-F-X. Okay, it's not a perfect diamond. I consider that cursed. It would need to be like... 
No, you can't make a diamond. They would have to have like a special keyboard for those to align as a diamond. They certainly don't align on my keyboard like that. <laughs> Why does this happen? Sometimes I just don't get the distance. <laughs> I touched the hair. Oh, oh. All right. All right. We can do this. I believe in myself and my friends and everyone who believes in me. Oh. All right. That is still leading us into the spike zone. And the spike zone is the dead zone. And I have made a terrible mistake. A terrible mistake. I don't know why I'm so slow sometimes on getting back there. All right, we can recover on that. Mm. All right, we reset. Reset. We hit this. We hit that. No, the rookie, you fucked it up. You had it, you had it, and then you dropped it. Why can't I hold any limes? All right, maybe having no limbs is giving me a problem because I can't hold. Fuck. Mother of God, I can't believe. I'm afraid to look at our death count. Fuck! Fuck! Ah. All right, we can recover. <laughs> oh, off you go, I'm afraid. Dreamer Arizel, into the void you shall travel. Hopefully it is not too spoopy and you can find your way back to the ziggurat given enough time. Time which I am going to use to die, live, die again. Fuck! Don't you love it when you just make that tiny little perfect pixel grab that kills you? It, it kills you. All right, so we go over here. Grab this, grab this. All right. You want to jump left? Jump up. Huh? No! It's too far away! And now I'm spinning, Duringar! Why are you doing this to me? Ah, 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 ah. Alright, I'll hydrate. <sighs> delicious, delicious water. Alright, so we just need to do it a little bit faster. Mm hmm, mm hmm. No, we got to jump left off the wall and then get back up. Oh, oh. Around. All right, we can fix this. Shum. All right, grab that, grab that, hit that, grab this. Grab this. Almost. We need a little bit faster. We just need to be a little bit faster. I just need to be a little bit faster. We have almost got this, chat. Chat, we have almost got this. Chat, I need to not step on the spikes, but we've got this. I believe. I believe in me who believes in you who believes in me. All right? It's just a chain of belief. Ah! 
you know, Chimera, thanks for thanks for trying to help out with the with the yeeting, but like we need to we need to make sure we yeet at the appropriate time so we can hit the uh the Kevin block. He's gotta go at just the right place, you know. Shit. All right, all right, all right, all right. We got this. We got this. I believe. I believe. All right, we still hit the spikes. Around and around. Hit the wall. Hit the bumper. Hit the Kevin. Grab. Jump. Jump too early. When in doubt, try, try again. And then if you still doubt, then keep on trying until you get to the end, my friend. I touched. Roses are red, violets are blue. Believe in me who believes in you. Exactly, Lupus. All right, we've kind of this one up. Listen, I tried. I just got to try again. <laughs> Yes. If at first you don't succeed, try, try again. Oh, oh, oh. Oh. Damn you, bumper. Damn you, bumper. It's frustrating because, like, I. I don't want to do the assist because, like, I can. S we're so close to solving it. So it's like, I don't want to use the assists to get through this. Yes! All right, all right. Oh, no! No! Right at the end! No! Why did you do this to me? Madeline, please! You're right there! You're right there! <laughs> I can't believe you! Oh, cocked by the spikes right at the finish line! The spikes are like, ooh, we're so pretty! Don't you want to touch us? We're like little flowers! It wouldn't hurt, but a bit! And then they get ya! All right, all right, all right. Huh. Yes! Yes! First try! First try! Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Also, hello, I just says Showed a clip of yours and thought you were cool. Aw, thanks. I certainly should be better about taking clips, but honestly, my brain is potato. I've been thinking of turning some of them just really quickly into YouTube shorts, just to also put them on YouTube, because why not? I did it. Oh, all right. Go me. Good job, past me. You did a good job. You remember to take that clip. <laughs> but welcome on by. I hope you enjoy TikTok. I don't think I would get TikTok. The only reason I will update upload to YouTube Shorts is because I already have a VOD channel for uploading all of my stream VODs. Um, that's actually why I came back to play Celeste, because I've been trying really hard to get all of my uh, VODs from the first year uploaded. And I was working through the Celeste ones, and I realized, you know, we have the entire B-sides in the last half of Farewell that I haven't done. Um, so I thought I'd go back and do them. TikTok might be banned soon, who knows? That's a whole thing. Like, here's the silly, 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 silliness about it. TikTok is the American subsidiary of, of a greater company. Like, they have a specific program for, for China. It's like a Chuyin, I think it is. And... China's been regul and and the Chuyin Chuyin has been regulated. So like anytime people are bringing up like the Chinese are seeing, you know, educational content and da 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 and then the Americans get this terrible, you know, attention abusing da da da. It's like that 
they put regulations for the type of content that can be on it and the length of the content. Like, my dude. But, uh, uh, uh American politicians would rather uh, uh, ban a company or force it to be sold than put any kind of regulation because, um, spoiler, all their complaints about data harvesting by TikTok is literally how most every social media platform functions. Like, if they regulate tick anything they would put in place to regulate TikTok would apply just as equally to Facebook or Twitter or anything else that makes its money by harvesting user data, aggregating it, and then selling it to other parties for advertising and targeting purposes. So it's... It's frustrating. I certainly would be fine with more regulation. Like, uh, the European Union has some really great uh, data privacy laws. Um, if you're not aware, the EU has an explicit right to be forgotten. You send in... If you send in a request to a company like, hey, delete me from all of your records, they have to honor it. And they have to remove you from all of their systems and anything that is associated with you. Um, we don't have that over in the United States or many other countries. And it's a very great uh, law because digital privacy is very important. Um, it's kind of one of the weird reasons, like, since I started streaming, I don't have a lot of, uh, skills on utilizing, uh, Twitter and the, all those media things, because I've always been very paranoid for my digital presence, and honestly would frequently Google myself to remove anything and scrub it off the internet as best I could. Uh, so that's why I don't have a lot of footprint. <laughs> kind of worked against myself, uh, ever since I started streaming. <laughs> Also be fine with more regulation on that front. Absolutely. Like short form media and gotcha loot box stuff are some big things that I feel need some serious regulation because it's the same. It's in the same realm as gambling where they're utilizing a lot of well-documented research and studies on how to manipulate the human mind. And it's like you, it's just like, you are not immune to propaganda. You are not immune from the techniques that gambling places and gotcha places use to get you to spend money. And leaving it to be this whole wild, wild west self-regulating thing is ripe for abuse. Um, it's one of the reasons why I, don't play a lot of gotcha because I find a lot of their systems are extremely exploitative. You know, I, I tried the Genshin Impact, but it, as soon as I ran into like actually utilizing the gotcha aspect of it outside of just exploring the like the map was cool. You know, I had fun working through those initial quests, but like the way the character unlocks work, all the what like all those systems. Um, the way, like, one of the big obfuscating ways that gotcha systems is the multiple currencies thing, you know, because, you know, they make it so complicated for you to figure all these things out. You know, it's just, it's just be easier if you just give them, you know, just 20, 30, 50, 100 bucks, and then you get all these fancy tokens, and then you just trade that one resource instead of getting a greeble, and then you trade 10 greebles for three gorbles, and then you accumulate 30 gorbles, which combine into one shmorple, and then if you make 10 shmorples, you can then translate that into a veeple, and then you use three veeples to have a one in 10 chance of getting a character unlock it's just it, it it's so confusing um <laughs> that's why i don't play gotcha games <laughs> that's probably will never play a gotcha game for stream as well um anyway uh thank you for talk coming to my ted talk let's deal with this spookiness hey uh hey hey squiggly void tentacles you uh you know, you're just a little bit shy Oh, well, that's okay. Uh, all right, so we need to go down, it looks like. Ah. All right, that's not too bad. 
I feel like that's a taste of what we're going to be experiencing, though. I didn't get the reset. I almost died. I need to launch myself off that second one. You track your currency, the corporal. <laughs> I didn't move far. Then for this reason, I'll play any gacha. We saw Pokemon Unite and saying that'd be interested in trying a Pokemon MOBA. We saw the monetization strategy movement. Yeah. And it's like, I don't mind like freemium stuff. Like Warframe, I feel I've always been pretty decently happy with it because it's, it's completely free. You know, a lot of the paid stuff is like purely cosmetics and nice. I, I, I'll grumble a little bit at how, you know, you have to pay to get more frame and weapon slots, but you can still get currency to unlock them. So it's not too bad. So like, I feel like Warframe exists in a fairly healthy spot. I do think it can be a little grindy at times and the way the vault system, at least last I played it. Last time I played Warframe, they had just launched, um, what was it? What the? What? How the f fuck is there a hype train? Tapes? Fucking damn it, tapes. Thank you for the subscriptions. What the fuck? Who'd you get? Who'd you get? You got Skull Slash, Fish Stick, Jazz Otter. Ooh. Oh, Iraziel. I hope you enjoy the emotes. Caboose, Lurkidian, Daydreamer Soma, Astro, <laughs> Astro Himbo. I need a himbo. And he's got to be strong and he's got to be sweet. <laughs> Seagreef, Gunwind, those are some nice, nice snipes. I I think the hype trains are broken. I'm gonna be honest, because it's supposed to kick off after three um things. I don't think did the new gift graphic play. I might, I might have been, I might have been too freaked out from the gift subscription, but there's a, I have a new, I have a, I have a specific animation for uh, gift subscriptions now. Um, um, it's an animation made by um, Trex, uh, a real pup. Uh, they are a really great pixel artist. A real pup. Oh no. Working on yep. 20 there they are. Hole? <laughs> but I wanted something with, you know, Drecky being like handed to someone and then just like a little gift bow thing. I thought it was very cute. Ah! Thank you so much, tapes. It is never necessary, but it is always appreciated. I hope everyone enjoys the emotes made by a variety of awesome artists. I feel like hitting the bumpers is making me like really floaty. Dead to sleep, gotta work at it. Oh no, I'm sorry, tapes. But I hope you can enjoy that delicious, delicious bread. I hope you have a fantastic rest of your evening and a rejuvenating eat, tapes. It's so weird. Sometimes I fly really far and sometimes I don't. I don't know what's going on with these bumpers. I feel like it might just be the angle that I'm hitting it at, which is a skill issue. No, I've been sitting here this whole time, the the song on this uh, 
B-side. And it reminds me of a song, and I just can't remember what it is. I'm going to need to scrub through my playlist to find it. Because it's something like low tempo with an acoustic guitar like this. Ah! Right into a wall. See, sometimes I go pretty far to the left. Other times I don't. <sighs> Fuck. What am I messing up here? Well, in that case, I fell onto the spikes. Clear, clear skill issue there. Oh, I could have just... All right, Drecky. Okay, dude. All right, we got some more spooky darkness. I wonder if we're going to do the battling shenanigans soon. I see. Ah! All right, I need to not launch myself. Launching myself kills myself. I still need to jump off of it, though. I like the way you say, ah. <laughs> I feel like I get good practice with it. All right, we went a little bit too far. I like the 29 ways you say, uh. <laughs> so the, it's the A and all, all the, all the octaves. You know, you got the A, you got the A and A, you got the A and C, you got the A and D, you got the A and flat, you know, you got to the A is the multitudinous A's. This is this like crystal thing over here. Ah, 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 ah. Oh, that's a, that's almost like an automaton. Oh. <laughs> Ow, my jaw popped. That's weird. I don't like my jaw popping. Nani, the ever-loving fuck. Oh. All right, I think I see what I need to do there. I need to not hit my head on them dang old spikes first off. I need to grab here, get that extra distance. Okay. Okay. Ah. Job pops up. Almost everything pops up. Ugh. Isn't that fun? Yay. All right. Okay. Go left. Hi, hi. Oh, hi. All right, what do we got now? I got a bunch of bullshit. That's what we got right now. We got a whole lot of bullshit. We got some perfect pixel little slidey doos. Aye. Yar, fuck. All right, we need to go. I think we need to go diagonal off that one. Nice jukes. Thanks. Mm. Wonder, I think I need maybe a little bit more height to get that one. Hmm. Seem to be slightly behind. Be back shortly. No problem.
I just let myself fall into the pink death. You know, if all these spikes were instead cotton candy, I feel like this would be a lot more uh, enjoyable. I wonder if I need to get my jump recharge, come back, re-grab the wall, and jump off the wall again. That feels like I'm just a little bit short. Yeah, that's the... I can't believe this bullshit. Nope, I fucked up. Drecky, you were supposed to go back and grab the wall. This is certainly making me want to go see the uh, video of the person who did all of Celeste Deathless. A sides, B sides, C sides, and farewell. Zero deaths. All in one run. And cotton candy would be even more difficult. Imagine death by cotton candy. Well, at least you would have some delicious food while you perished, you know? Ah, so close. So close. No matter how far, couldn't be much more from the heart. Forever trust in who we are. And everything else matters. Huh? Hmm, a little too sharp on that. Hmm. Come on, come on, come on, we got this. Regrab. Huh? We have to be like pixel perfect on those last two drops. Trixie, Trixie. Ah! I hate when I do that. Come on, come on, come on. Mm, just need to get a little bit more to the right. Resilient Void, welcome on by. Sloop Peak. <laughs> oh. 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 All right. Survey says dead. I would cry with this game. Your platforming skill is four out of. Oh. I mean, the assist mode is still very effective. If you if you still want to and I still experience the story, so I feel like they make the game extremely accessible. And I've certainly utilized it um, at a few areas that I just was getting frustrated at and it was just blocking progress. Like, I may be dying a lot, but it's, I know what I need to do and like, I'm not, I'm not frustrated. I just know I need to get things right. You know, it, it'll take a couple tries, but I'm okay with that. Um, when I get frustrated is when I don't see any possible way of how to solve or um i know back when i did farewell um and they introduced the jellyfish there was a critical mechanic of the jellyfish that i never noticed and wasn't explicitly explained and it was severely making me suffer to make progress in it um and i ended up using the assist in a lot of places to keep getting through farewell but ever since then i've i've learned like it was something about like being able to throw the jellyfish straight up and immediately re-grab it for extra height or something like that that i didn't realize i could do and i was just getting through some areas by being extremely precise rather than doing ah almost we almost made it to the last corridor other than uh, uh the proper way or the easier way of like throwing it upward and re-grabbing it or something. That is one nice thing. The A lot of Celeste has some wiggle rooms. You know, there isn't one 
specific solution. There's certainly an intended solution, but there's a lot of places you can circumvent by just precise or clever platforming. Also, thank you for the head pats. Cut is generally good at figuring out what I need to do, but failing at making it happen. Yeah. The execution is definitely frustrating. It's certainly why I won't be doing any of the seasides or the extra difficult modded Celeste because my, I don't, I don't have the hands for like high level execution. Like there's some really fascinating movement techniques in Celeste. I can sort of do some of the intermediate ones uh, occasionally, um, but I can't consistently do like a hyper wave dash, you know, all sorts of stuff that's like frame perfect. It's just, I, I don't have the hands for that. Uh, I've never been super fuck, uh, precision player. Always been more of a strat strategic kind of person. Like whenever I played some amateur StarCraft 2, um, I was never amazing at micro, but I was usually really good at macro and knowing how to outplay opponents in the broader strategic sense. Um, which kind of made up for my inability to do a lot of like precision stuff with micro. Of course, at a certain level of competitiveness, you need to have the micro and macro. And I wasn't good enough as a strategy to continue making improvements. Ah, I need to tap. I need to tap back just a little bit at the end of that one. I get so close. Here's why you love Rivals of the a Aether, but can never really play it. Hmm, I never heard of Rivals of the Aether. No, I dashed too early. I also love how seamless the music is. Like, I can't even tell it's looping, but it is just perfect. No! So close, so close. We got this. We can do this, chat. You just gotta take it easy. One section at a time. One input at a time. One spike in the butt at a time. No, I do not recommend inserting spikes in the butt. They are very painful and may cause harm. If you or a loved one has been impaled by pink spikes, call JG Whitworth. I'm, mi I'm mixing up my advertisements now. <laughs> I was thinking of the Mesothemioma ads, but I accidentally went with the JG Wentworth one. <laughs> ah! mm -hmm. So close, chat. So close. I didn't grab the wall. Rivals of the Aether is a sprite-based platform. For oh. Interesting. Hmm, too far to the right. Like, we're fairly consistent in getting to that spot. It's that last little... Ah, for some reason, we go, like, a little too far, and I don't know why. Hmm... What other ways can I use to control my aerial momentum? Hmm. Ah, too far down. Y'all know we'll throw in a second pink spike. <laughs> you call it out. We'll throw in a second pink spike. Completely free. That's right. Two pink spikes in the ass for the price of one easy payment of $249.99. This special deal is a limited time offer. So call now before supplies run out. Meanwhile, a giant warehouse 
stuffed ground to floor of pink spikes. Ah! Why do we keep going too far to the left there? I don't understand. It's so weird. I needed to go back and re-grab. Been a while since we messed up at that part. Oopsie doodle. I wonder if I need to grab it, move a little to the right, and then dash left. Like, I need to hit it, tap right, dash left. Because hmm. we just need a little bit more space to make it in the hole. That hole is the goal. Mm, so close. On the screen at two size font says a plus eighty four ninety nine shipping and handling. Be careful of the house at the end of the road. It becomes a strange place at the full moon. Susan, you must leave me! But tonight is a full moon. No, Derek, I'll stay with you, whatever it is. Susan, you don't understand. I'm a warehouse. <laughs> Garage door opening. <laughs> hey, I'm picking up with your foot down. I'm tracking. <laughs> Now, everyone always talks about werewolves, but they never ask why wolf or how's your evening wolf? <sighs> They're so nosy. No, oh, I thought we had it. I thought we had it. Alas, Madeline longs for the spikes. You know, Madeline, I know you don't have the pink hair for a double jump, but uh, the pink spikes don't help, honey. You ain't gonna get your double jump by touching the pink spikes. They're forbidden for a reason, Madeline. <gasps> Survey says, get fucked, let's go. How you doing, both? <laughs> All right, so we got, a, we got a series of jumps here. Uh, this is a weird room. Ah! Okay, rude. Ow. Uh, all right, so we have to bump her, grab the wall. Uh, wait, what? Hit that. Boink. Uh, all right, this is weird. Boink. I keep expecting the wind to be pushing me back and it's throwing me off. Hmm. Boing, grab that. Die like the terrible, terrible person I am. Because Battlin is going pew pew. Yar fuck. Yar fuck. Oh, okay, so we need to grab left, wait for that to fall, jump to it right. I don't think they're trying to not be rude. Ah! Trying to get fancy with it, aren't you? Yeah, well, I want to try and be a little fancy schmancy. Unfortunately, I don't know fancy. I'm not, I'm no fancy, fancy smith. Fancy mancer. Fancy schmancer. Ah! 
Boing, grab that. All right, we need to move a little bit faster. Yar, har, fiddly fuck. You're a pirate and all out of luck. Yeah, it's like that classic animation, you know? All right. Okay, dude. Okay, dude. All right, that was deceptively simple. Ah! The feather has led me astray. And now it has killed me. All right, all right. Hmm, we have a feather down there, do we? And we got a little bit of a feather down there, don't we? Huh? Well, oh, Madeline, perhaps you should have thought of that before dying. No, it, Madeline. You've achieved death. This is not the way. You should be touching Madeline. You've got to get through her laser beams. You must achieve synthesis. Fuse with your evil half. Become two sides of a coin. Become more powerful than ever before, Madeline. God damn it. I am dying. Squirtle. Squirtle, I'm dying. All right, we hit that. All right, all right, I see how it is. I see how it is. I see how it is. All right, all right. It is kind of fun to have like a boss fight in uh, Celeste. Aha, you can't kill me. Only I kill me. I, see, I told you, only I kill me. Oh, to perish right at finish line. Oh, to perish right at the midline. Oh, to perish at the starting line. Chat, we seem to have regressed. Ah, all right, we're making progress again. All right, we hit that. Hit the feather. We zoop the loop, we do a boop, and then we do not fall down, we go through, we go down, and we boop, and we die, and I cry, and I go down, we hit this, and I die, and I cry, and we go down, we do this, we touch Madeline, we grab, we dash, we grab, we ups, we downs, we touch, arounds, all right, this is this is a bit of a weird one. Ah! I got fireballs. Great balls of fire, Madeline. My one weakness, balls. And you know, death pits. Those also kill me. I don't know why I keep failing to grab that wall. Hmm. Oops, too, they went down too sharply. All right, so go up and around, touch, go down, around, need to dash. Too far up. Need to curve left more. Need to touch the feather, Drecky. Touch her. Regrab this. Oh, I need to hit her. Okay. 
All right, all right. I think I think we know I think we know the strategy on this one. Grab this. We do a loop here. Ah, uh, the dash put me too far away. Damn. Okay, it's got to calm down, take it easy, shake it off. <laughs> well, not that easy, Madeline. You're gonna have to at least jump. Uh. All right, I don't know what happened there, but we recover. We fuck up. Actually, we actually actually we didn't recover. We fucked up. And we fucked up. Boink. Boink. Go right up around. Boink. No! I fell too far. I fell too far. Way deep down. Down, down, down. All right, we can't go straight up like that. We hit the spikes once again. Okay, we hit that ah, face into the spikes. Come on. Come on, Drecky. You've got this. We hit this. We need to go middle, diagonal, diagonal down, hit her. We go up, around town. All right, we might need to curve left a little bit just so we have enough room for that U turn. I went over the recharge. I must flee. But I believe in you. Well, thanks for believing in me. That's real. And I hope you have a fantastic rest of your evening and a rejuvenating eep. Oh, oh, ah! Oh, oh, yeah! Got a chick. Got a choo. Diagonal. Boink. Dash, 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 up. Come on, we got this. Our result, our result. Ah, it's the extra A. My bad. Thank you for letting me know. No! Survey says I am a chuckle fuck. A little fuckle chuck. Chuckle fucking around. Ah! Dash too early. Dash too early. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right. Bada bing, bada boom, feather. Feather in our cap, no caps. Ah. I didn't think I got the feather. I thought I had missed it. Jarzia, ah. Jarzia. Gato raid, gato raid, gato raid. Hello, hello. I'm here twice now. <laughs> welcome, 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 everyone. Candy Dagger, Fang, Bushcrank, John Nather, fancy seeing you here. Daydreamer Soma. I hope all of y'all had a fantastic time. Ooh, Crisabal. Jazzy, I, I hope the I hope the little brain world Jazzy art turned out well. What? 
the fuck? Six months, Chazia. Thanks for re snug scribing. Well, everyone, welcome, welcome, welcome. If you're coming here from Jazia's stream and you have somehow, you've probably been too entranced by all of the amazing, you know, art that she draws, all of the cool videos and memes that go on, you know, uh, you might have forgotten to follow Jazia. I'll make it easy for you. You know, I just press this button. Now you can just press a button and then you can check out that gator whenever they go live again. Jazia, uh, you were going for a little while. So, you know, take it easy. Leave a piss. Take a water. Probably grab water from someplace different than where you piss, but I'm not your keeper. You do you. Y'all don't know me. I'm Drekki Ormer, Draconic Serpent, Flightless Dragon, or simply Worm on the Internet. We're working on the Celeste B-sides and hopefully finishing the latter half of Farewell as well. Um, I, we're almost got this. <laughs> ooh, 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 ooh. Ooh, you sent the doodle over. Well, well, well. We need to get that open now, don't we? All right, so if I grab this and then I go to browser source, and I can do that. Look at it. Look at that adorable piece of art that Jaws DMA. It's just a, uh, it's just a little, little like rainbow little lizard, but it's Jazia, a little blepper, just nip, nip, nip. <laughs> and a little bow on the tail. Ah, oh, absolutely adorable, absolutely fantastic, awesome Jazia, awesome. I'm not gonna lie, as soon as I saw you had a uh, channel point sketch redeem, I was planning on on redeeming this, so I've just been waiting until I built up. <laughs> Oh, Soma, I'm afraid you're heading off into the void. I, I hope you can make your way back eventually. What button? This button? <laughs> well, welcome to the Ziggurat Crisp Ball. I hope you enjoy your time here. So cute, draws Spear. Push crank. No, no. You gotta tame Jazia. You gotta bring delicious, delicious. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know what you, gumbo, maybe? I don't know. I don't know, like, what, what. Jazia, what food would be used to tame you as a lizard? Like, what's your preferred food? Because all lizards actually do have food preferences. Remember you threatening it once? <laughs> all my threats aren't idle. I made it. Darkie's very close. Oh, There is no taming. Only death awaits. Mean. I got lasered. Love some seafood gumbo. Or even just some red beans and rice. Mmm. Red beans. Key lime. Jazia. Stop it. Stop it. Now I want some jambalaya. You draw me with plain rice. <laughs> Little wait, wait, rice with mayo? All right, you lost me with the mayo, Jazia. You lost me with the mayo. I'll use mayo with my fries, but I'm not going to put it on my rice. Oh, this is a long room. I see. Great. Fuck. Cilantro lime rice. I'll take that. Cilantro lime rice. That's pretty ballin'. Oink. I didn't make it. Make some amazing jambalaya. The only thing is, is I don't like seafood. So it's got to be some like andouille sausage. That's usually how I make my uh, jambalaya. You missed! Ah, oh, the spikes got me. 
Mayo on fries? Yeah. Uh, some ketchup and mayo. Because it's like a... It's a bit like of a Thousand Island dressing. I like Thousand Island. I died once again. Okay, Chipotle mayo is the best iteration of mayo. I, I'll concede that point. I mean, I wouldn't say anything. Not everything needs mayo. Died! I have died once again. And do sausage? Yeah. What, am I saying it wrong? That's how I've always said it. <laughs> no, don't tell me I've been pronunciating it wrong this whole time. No. Although, frankly, uh, there is a Cuban place I've been to that has some yucca fries with, like, a garlic dip. That shit fucking slaps. Is it mayo and ketchup pink sauce? I mean, I think technically mayo and ketchup is, like, Russian dressing. I don't remember the difference between Russian dressing and Thousand Island. I feel like Thousand Island has one more ingredient, but I'm not 100% sure. Hey, Iced, welcome on by. Am I full of bees? I am full of the bees' knees. Help me. Help me. There's so many bees! Turns out making art of a gummy worm makes you hungry. <laughs> Shrunk walk twice, walk twice. Shrunk rot twice. Something something white. I don't know what I expected there. Wee! Oh, I need it to actually launch me. Noted. Do I keep that again? Need to go. Get up at five a.m. Ah. Jazia, thank you for stopping on by. I hope you have a fantastic, rejuvenating eat. Ah! Ah! All right, this uh, this is this is some this is some advanced Kevin. Translate means cabinets red white. Does he white? <laughs> I mean, all languages get a little bit silly when you start translating them. Huh? Too far. Good night in a month. <laughs> Success! Ah, she has a laser. Shit, she has my one weakness. Bullets. Ah! All right, this kills the Madeline. Ow. Yes, we don't mix it, it's the sin in Germany. <laughs> All right, so we need to dash. We need to get on there. Ah! All right. I believe. I believe in you, Madeline. Believe in me who believes in you, Madeline. Damn it, Madeline. I said believe, not get lasered. It's be le It's be live, not be lasered, Madeline. I know. I know they sound similar, but come on. Come on! 
Where, where's a, where's a concave uh, lens when you need it? You know, we just need to disperse these lasers a bit. You know, defuse the damage. You know, it's a sin, but surprisingly okay. Banana slices and marinara. They're talking about like a. They're talking about like. Oh, I'm thinking salsa for some reason. I don't know why I was thinking banana slices and salsa. Well, what kind of marinade? Because, like, there's a lot of marinades. I prefer having my banana slices on, like, a peanut butter and honey sandwich. What the fuck am I supposed to do on there? I did not make it, but I tried it and I didn't hate it. Hmm. I think the last thing I had that was kind of like that for me was kimchi mac and cheese. I was like, oh, I gotta try this. And it surprisingly slapped. Tomato sauce, I don't know. Oh, hmm. That is kind of weird. All right, I need to maybe do a short stop on that middle block just so I can try and dodge the laser. Try being the operative word right now and uh, Madeline is not a doctor. All right, so we hit that. I don't know why I'm mussing this up so much. This seems like a very simple room, but things have just been weird. I keep just pressing the wrong dang button. I feel like we've got to be getting to the end of this section though. Oh, it becomes like a back and forth little thing on the bottom of jig. All right, that makes more sense. Uh, all right. I think I know what I need to do. I need to hit that. No, that's not what I need to do. All right. Hmm. No. It actually slaps Old Bay Shrimp Fried Alfredo Pasta. <laughs> Or that's a European's lemon and salt on mango is sacrilege. Hmm. I mean, I would say uh, jalapenos in Alfredo sauce are really good because uh, I worked at a Tex-Mex place for a while and or a Tex-Mex Italian fusion restaurant. That was pretty nice. So uh, uh, a lot of, you know, some of that Mexican flair in Italian dishes is pretty nice.